Hello and welcome to Virtual Learning Channel. Beginning with Java 15, Java provides support for text blocks. A text block is a new kind of literal that is comprised of a sequence of characters that can occupy more than one line. It is useful when creating line string literals because new line characters can be used in a text block without the need for the backslash n escape sequence. Furthermore, tab and double quote characters can also be entered directly without using an escape sequence and the indentation of a multi-line string can be preserved. A text block is supported by a new delimiter, three double quote characters. A text block is created by enclosing a string with a set of these delimiters. Specifically, a text block begins immediately following the new line after the opening with three double quote characters. So the line containing the opening delimiter must end with a new line. The text block begins on the next line. A text block ends at the first characters of the enclosing three double quote characters. This example creates a string in which the line virtual learning channel is separated from JDK 17 new features playlist by a new line. It is not necessary to use the backslash n escape sequence to obtain the new line. So the next block automatically preserves the new lines in the text. Again, the text block begins after the new line following the opening delimiter and ends at the start of the closing delimiter. So the new line after the second line is also preserved. Before going to our example, if you have not subscribed to my channel yet, I want to ask you to subscribe my channel and also give me a like to encourage me making more videos. Thank you. Let's see an example together. It is important to emphasize that even though a text block uses three double coated delimiter, it is of type a string. Because the last line ends with a new line, that new line will also be in the resulting string. If you don't want a trailing new line, then put the closing delimiter at the end of the last line. In this example, the text in the block was placed flush left. However, this is not required. You can have leading white space in a text block. There are two primary reasons that you might want leading white space. First, it will enable the text to be better aligned with the indentation level of the code around it. Second, it supports one or more levels of indentation within the text block itself. In general, leading white space in a text block is automatically removed. However, the number of leading white spaces to remove from each line is determined by the number of leading white spaces in the line with the last identation. For example, if all lines are flush left, then no white space is removed. If all lines are indented two spaces, then two spaces are removed from each line. This removes unwanted leading space while preserving the indentation of text within the block. Another advantage to text block is the ability to use double quote without the need for the backslash double quote escape sequence. As you can see, there was no need to use the backslash double quote escape sequence. So because double quotes are treated as normal characters, there is also no need for them to be balanced within a text block. The escape sequences such as backslash n or backslash t can be used in a text block. 
However, because double quotes, new lines, and tabs can be entered directly, they will not often be needed. So, with the addition of text blocks, two new escape sequences were added to Java. The first is backslash s, which specifies a space, and it can be used to indicate trailing spaces. The second is backslash end of line because the backslash must be followed by a line terminator it must be used only at the end of the line in a text block the backslash prevents a new line character from being included at the end of its line the backslash is essentially a line continuation indicator Please notice that backslash end of line can only be used in a text block.